Today we are here at Homo Dojo and I would like to show some trainings, explanation that Sido Jordan is given to Sensei Rebecca concerning Tazuke Jime. Let's uh, watch what is happening here in the Homo Dojo. Okay, as you can see, Sido Jordan is performing one join lock, wrist lock after the attack and he's trying to, it's putting the the inside of the in, the wrist inside the tazuki tazuki remember that this uh, rope that is usually put in order to uh, to care of the sode to care of the sleeves in this case of course that the tazuki is not necessary because we are with more modern gi, we are not with the yukata, Shido Jordan, Shido Jordan, it could, he could wear this tazu gi. But since Rebecca is carrying the typical keiko gi and it's not needed tazu gi, but anyway, in order to care for this kind of forms on Aiki Jujutsu, is the tazu gi jime. This tazu gi jime means tazu gi is the robe, the jime means to close, to suit then means to suit the, the technique inside the Tazuki and it's part of the Okuden level of Aiki Jiu Jitsu right now as you could see one wrist is in the inside of the of one side of the Tazuki and the other it's also controlled by the Tazuki itself right now she's on the ground, she's controlled and the final control with both hands inside the tazuki right now releasing the partner now after the attack of Mako Uchi take a look how the wrist is being placed in order to perform this kind of forms you could see the hand is going inside the tazuki in order to control on this form of Koti Hineri as you can see put the Osai on the other hand and it's restrained the right with the Tazuki and the left right now passing by here and control on both sides it's another form of this special study concerning this uh, Tazuki Jime Take a look how it's restrained one hand and the other it's in the inside of the Tazuki. A release for the next attack. It's attacking Yoku Menuchi, performing this movement. The hand is prepared. Take a look how it's impossible to escape, how the back is in balance and the energy, the force is completely drained to that putting the opponent face down to the ground and having also the control on the other by restraining both arms in this way this is completely, you could see the left hand has been controlled and the other was in the inside and also placed close to the, close to the, to the neck after trying to strike on Tsuki, passing the side, this is a Kotegaish form. Take a look how the, the wrist is restrained and the inside and is right now close on the inside of the Tazuki. And now the knee is over the scapula and the final control is perfect. with a normal grip of I hand me the kubitori right now pass to the other side she is right now close to being choked but at the same time the wrist is restrained and caught in into the tasuki as you could see this tasuki could be uh, uh, something that it's against the the one that carries and now it's controlled on this position very particular on 
like being sit down, like seeing a position, and being restrained one side and the other with both of them. Of course, that we are on an explanation in order to look for the details that this method is bringing to us. Okay, as you have seen, there are very interesting information, uh, forms studied in the past, that uh, it's, very, it's very nice to watch here in the Hombu Dojo how is the Sidoshi are prepared, and with the mastery of Sidoshi Yodan teaching and explaining all these forms. I hope that you have enjoyed the same that I do, and thank you very much, and see you on the next video. Thank you very much. Mm -hmm.